Welcome back. Now we will uh, discuss about Pressler's formula for increment percent. Now Pressler gave a formula for increment percent. Uh, how uh, we have to understand that if V is the volume of the crop as at present, uh, capital V, and small V is the volume n years ago, and n is fairly short. Then current annual increment. You already know that in the uh, preceding growth in the preceding year growth in the uh, current year divided by the number of years so this is capital v minus small v upon n this is the uh, current annual increment that we got now uh, what is the average uh, crop that has produced this increment v is equal to v plus v upon 2 we got an increment this but over which uh, volume which is uh, uh, v plus v upon 2 now how we have we, we we need to recall the definition of increment percent the average annual growth in volume basal area over a specified period expressed as the percentage of volume or basal area either at the beginning or more usually halfway through the period means we have to take average of both the volumes means v is capital v plus small v upon 2 it will be considered as the volume upon which this increment was received so we 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 just simply don't have to write only uh, v here but we uh, so, uh, the small v here but we have to take average of both the volumes which is v plus v upon 2 now uh, we got x we got y how to work out the percentage x upon y into 100 this is the simple formula so P is equal to increment upon volume. This is the X is increment and Y is volume. This is increment and this is volume into 100. So we put this formula V minus V upon N and uh, divide uh, it by V, upon, v plus V upon 2 which uh, uh, becomes uh, you know 2 upon V plus V into 100 by simple arithmetic and ultimately we get p is equal to v minus v upon v plus v into 200 by n this is the pressler's formula in case of v now if we express the same formula in terms of diameter as we know the volume and diameter has a square relationship we can we have to write d square minus small d square upon d square plus small d square into 200 upon and why I am telling this because we will, uh, um, you know, uh, face this in the next slides. So, for, for example, take an example to understand this Pressler's formula. Uh, the volume at the age of 50 years is 2500 cubic centimeter. Uh, at the age of 60 years, 3500 cubic feet, uh, sorry, cubic feet, cubic feet. And uh, thinning at the age of 55 years gave, this is the extra you know uh, thing that we got here 300 cubic feet then increment percent by Pressler's formula you already know that V V this is your V minus small V this is your capital V plus small V into 200 upon e number of years is 10 so why you have added 300 because this is the extra thing that you got volume uh, was uh, 3500 plus we added 300 here also we added 300 this becomes v and we subtracted uh, you know volume at the age of 50 years volume at the age of 60 years and uh, ultimately we got 4.13 so 1.4.13 is the increment percent using Pressler's increment in this formula now Pressler discovered an uh, another law uh, that increment percent for the year in which MAI culminates can be expressed by the formula P is P is equal to 100 uh, minus R. You already know that uh, this is uh, the MAI curve and this is the CI curve. Here is the point of culmination. And he told that we are at the point of culmination at this point. This is your CI and this is your MAI. This one this curve so he told that at this point p at this point p is equal to 100 upon r now how you know that this is the pressler's formula <coughs> and if we rearrange the terms 
v minus v upon n into 200 upon we take the terms here and there in the uh, in the year and r when mai culminates at this point of culmination we know ci is equal to mei now this is the formula for cai v minus v upon n and this is the formula for mei how v plus v upon 2 is the volume and we divide the whole term by r number up that is that means volume by r is mei so ci is equal to mei so rearranging the terms here v minus v upon n into 200 is equal to this and this we are multiplying uh, by 200 on both sides ultimately what we are going to get is v minus v upon n into 200 upon v plus v is equal to 100 upon r so this is nothing but increment percent given by the increment formula given by the Pressler. So the increment at uh, the point where MEI and CIR equal is equal to 100 upon R.